again, I could be wrong. Superhead, of course, playing uh, Game & Watch. He's playing uh, Pokemon Trainer, playing uh, Pyra Mithra, where Cheeks, on the other hand, is just playing All Out Roy. And Cheeks has been the killer of DFW, but we have seen upsets already. It couldn't happen to you. It can happen to Drew. It definitely can. And uh, honestly, more Mithra and Pyra. Like last week, I saw like three or four different ones in top eight. They're, they were trying it out. Like this character is definitely um, something that I, I think we didn't know what to think. And now she's everywhere. She's absolutely everywhere just because she's so strong and neutral. Uh, excuse me? What was that interaction there? <laughs> now I'm like a hit with uh, four Smash. said, no, I'm hitting a Smash attack now. <laughs> <laughs> this character war is actually ridiculous. My favorite DLC character. I I love, yeah. I love Roy so much. I really think that like Roy, like Chrom and Roy are some like the funnest characters to watch. Their disadvantage and advantage is like super uh, uh super tight. Oh, what the was that confirmed to that combo? Cheeks, you're looking absolutely ridiculous. And jab to bear the classic. Uh, gets a sour spot. He doesn't care. He's gonna take this forward smash. Cheeks is looking really hot right now. And Cheeks is also a dabbled uh, in his. Part of the character crisis that he did have, he didn't mess around with Pirate Mithra a little bit, so maybe he knows a little bit of ins and outs that we don't know. I I don't doubt that he knows because he's always preferred these sword characters. Um, you know, being the the prominent Cloud main, and then he was playing uh, Lucina for a bit. Oh my God! Goodness gracious! What is going on? What are these confirms? What are these combos? He is. Oh my gosh! Cheeks right now has all the hot sauce in the world, and he's trying to uh, give my man a heartburn. He's uh, kind of absolutely killing it right now. What's the grab right there? Look at this, not get punchable if it's oh. done. The brave dash attack, the tis pie dash attack. Like, I, I love the option, do nothing, stand still, and dash attack. It, it works. <laughs> I mean, it definitely did. Uh, once again, both of these guys are phenomenal players, too. Cheeks is going to be, like, potentially number one on our PR, unless someone else has something to say about it. Uh, no, I think I think Cheeks owes all oh, did you, What? Did his forward tilt? Hit the shield when he was facing the other way. Hey, man, Rory needs it. <laughs> oh my god. All the aggressive side beat. This is actually potential. This could potentially come back. The problem is here is that you got Rory versus Mithra. Uh, or Pyra, I'm Pyra. sorry. <laughs> uh, but that being said, he's in the corner. He's in disadvantage. Oh. Next big hit will definitely kill him. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's a punish. Wait, wait, no! Oh, that, that's a punish, but not that type of punish. Oh, gosh. Um, but Roy actually can deal with. Um, uh, with this uh, ledge tr or this edge uh, edge guarding from uh, from Pyra, just because of his own recovery, uh, because he can go right under her and kind of take the hits. Oh God! I don't think he meant to do that. I don't think he meant the roll after uh, reacting to the uh, uh, the roll from Pyra. I think he meant to actually do back air, ah, but uh, okay. he actually got the wrong buffer there. If I'm, I'm pretty sure. All right, but well, we've been talking a lot about Cheeks. How about we start talking about Superhead, who has a lead. Uh, it, it is gone, but Superhead uh, making the right decisions here, and it is tied up. We are at zero apiece. Yeah, uh, the incredibly important game here, especially in the best of three, taking the first game. And you uh, know what? Uh, best within, I was a big fan. Let's make the sequel. Uh, best within two. Gosh, that just made me cringe. <laughs> foresight. Wow, the side so, tilt and the forward smash? That's oh the thing? Oh my god! He doesn't have a what, jump! What? He doesn't have a jump! Oh, oh, but he doesn't capitalize on the edge guard and Cheeks is back on stage. Right. This man is scary, but he might be dead! Oh, no, 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 no. Well, now relax. Cheeks can absolutely. Uh, one stray hit from Roy can lead to massive damage. Here we go. Oh, the commitment to the dash attack. Uh oh, read the option here. He read Gets the ledge stage. Uh, the what a wake up down tilt. Uh oh, what's the platform? Oh, the side B will not lead into a confirm, though. All right. What a... He floated all the way back so that we didn't get oh, hit. Oh, he tried to punish, but he was too far away. Oh, oh. clean with the swords. We heard the metal. Oh, what, Gets a down I? tilt. Oh. He was looking for the side B to end his life. Oh, I'm scared! Does Hold not on. get the kill there. This is very close. Jab back in. We'll be able to close the Chiefs committed. Oh. oh, we're last. Oh, he's looking forward. What can he get here? Oh my gosh, he's going for these burning edge, but he doesn't get it. Oh, but he'll still live. Jeff almost actually killed him there. It was actually kind of wild. Let's see if Cheeks can get back down to the ground. Oh, holding geez. shield, tilting his shield. Oh, the dash attack, and that'll take the first game. Oh my gosh, first of all, Cheeks is so patient. He just stood on the platform and was like, I'm just going to wait. Like, yeah, I mean, he tried, he tried to wait for, you know, Superhead to do anything on his shield. That's why you said so I'm keep tilting the shield and whatnot, trying to react to like, you know, where he can get hit so he won't get shield poked. Mm -hmm. I mean, that was really good stuff from Cheeks, but man, I feel like 
the the Tiss Pie like dash attack. For, for those who are not aware why he's saying Tiss Pie like dash attacks, Tiss Pie has the bravest dash attacks of all time. He went rolling off the whole stage <laughs> and like, <laughs> and we saw it in the first stalk he took. He just stood there and said, Boop. Yeah, he's like, I'm running to knowing this, man. If you if you don't block, this is all on you. <laughs> and sometimes you have to do that. Sometimes you have to have that courage as a player. And and you know what? And he was rewarded for it. And that's why Superhead is up 1-0 against Cheeks. And uh, I'm sure he would like to make this 2-0 and continue on on his run here. But uh, right now, really good job using uh, Mithra to take this. Well, I mean, I said a good job. It's right. 51% wow. immediately off a of one there. Oh. And a bad guess. Oh my gosh, Pan punishing the option. Oh, that's a grab. Okay, this is still a little bit terrifying for uh, Cheeks for getting out the corner versus Pyra. Is Pyra Loki has like some really good options to kind of keep you in there. Oh, oh. and that down there. Can Superhead make this, up? I don't want to say upset, but can he get the win here against what people are feeling like the king of DFW at this moment? Well, you know what? He's looking really good right now. Superhead absolutely showing why he deserves a lot of respect, especially what, for what he's been doing. He performs pretty well, but if he were to beat Cheeks here, this would be a big feather in his cap. Oh, does not get the two frame on his there there. Oh. Cheeks is swinging at him. He wants oh. the end of the stock and gets the end of the side beat because of the air dodge in. 37% is not too bad, especially if he gets a one little Nair combo with the, you know, nonsense. Yep, uh, Roy can absolutely combo uh, Pyro and Mithra pretty well off one straight hit, whether it's Nair or, or a grab. Double force match, the force match again? You absolute monster, why would you do that? All right, try, um, Cheeks tries to call out an aggressive option, but uh, instead Superhead just switches over. Oh, oh man, these force matches are just like covering his landings in the most perfect way possible. I think he, I think he understands that Cheeks wants to tomahawk grab him a little bit. Oh, here we go. Oh, reads the tech, or reads the option. Oh, tries to go for a flare blade. Can't punish that move. That move is apparently super good on shield. Yeah, flare blade is very good. These force matches. Who are you? Oh, that's gonna be a punish. Oh, oh what, what, watch out! What's the option? How did up air hit? What the? What type of hitbox was that? What in the world? Oh, oh. He, the DLC he, hitbox. Oh, cheeks! I love this down tilt pressure from him. Uh, trying to read what uh what Superhead wants to do. Superhead didn't panic though. Wow, he gets a sour spot that back here. That definitely probably would have killed for him. That is so smart. Uh, such a good way to deal with uh, her, uh, Mithra's recovery. Did you see that? Yeah. He like immediately jumped fast fall air dodge, so he had enough time to punish the whip. Very good stuff. And he just got the lead again here. Gets hit with the uh, the up B there. Won't kill him though, so he's luckily in a good area. And another one of these four smashes. I don't know what Superhead has uh, for these downloads for these four smashes, but they're the best thing ever. Oh, uh, Foresight. Oh man, Foresight being such a nuisance. Uh, Roy actually having to respect uh, Mithra when she's a disadvantage. Oh gosh. Uh, he should be fine here, I think. Yeah, he's yeah. gonna be able to get back the ledge. With the grab, not getting too punished there. This is a precarious situation for uh, Cheeks right now. He's yeah. looking not too great. The next like big hit will probably put him off stage. Every, and... So so these nares from uh, from Superhead have been so good. Oh! oh, he tried. He was just a little too low a percentage. That definitely would have done it. It wasn't that he was low in percentage. That he went through the bottom instead of uh, hitting the platform. So if he hit the platform, he actually would have got the confirm there. That was super good for Cheeks and oh. luckily for Cheeks that worked out for him amazingly enough. Oh and he's about God. to carry right carry away this momentum right now. The next big hit. If you get Jab Bear, it's over. Oh. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Don't know like this! No! <laughs> Unfortunate for Superhead, but fantastic for Cheeks as we get a game three in this sword battle right now. The buffer system has taken another soul. Oh my! Uh, I I I feel bad. It was, I, it was an alternate universe where he got that there. Cheeks was on the platform. He hit the platform. And he got the up smash, and Superhead got it 2-0. And was in winners, what I think finals. I, I I like that, but that was not the future that we're in right now. <laughs> yeah. But it potentially can be. We're here at game three, winners semifinals, running it back to battlefield. We're in Earth 62, man. So like, just accept what we have to deal with. Uh, make good with what you have. And uh, I don't think Superhead's gonna uh, think about it too much because he's got oh already building up 56% basically. I think I covered all, all all options as far as like taking on the platform. That was really good. Really good stuff so far. Um, so he went back to Battlefield. Um, what do you think about this uh, selection against uh, Roy? Oh, God! Well, I think that, you know, he's probably regretting it just a tad bit. Just oh. a tad bit as his shield is now blown up by Cheeks, and Cheeks has got a solid lead here. 
man. He popped himself a bubble. That thing went crack. Like, um, you know, it's funny because, like, we just talked about, like, what Superhead was doing here. But, like, Cheek, Cheeks is so good at adapting and, like, trying to find uh, little habits. Oh, he whiffed that. Cheeks is looking for these, uh, for these buttons. But he just didn't get the punish that time. It's the up air and not looking too good for him. Inside the air dodge to the platform. That was really smart, actually. The one option that he probably wasn't going to cover there. Oh man, like like Cheeks is uh, his movement is absolutely phenomenal, especially on these platforms. Like he knows exactly where what the options are on the defensive end. Oh my God! And this all was a different reality because my man did not get the downer on the platform and did not get the L smash to connect there. And and, and again, it's it's the patience of Cheeks. Pa oh, I mean, I I don't want you to be too patient when you're down there, but like. As I was saying, like, the patience of Cheeks is why he got that punish. Like, Mithra uh, pushed a bunch of buttons on his shield, and he just waited. Oh, they're, they're getting trades that's only favorable for Cheeks just because he has the lead at the moment. <laughs> I'll try to get something fancy there. Oh, counter. Uh, I, maybe he uh, he thought he was still going to be on the platform. Okay, that down air did not lead to the combo he was looking for. That's why we said the immediate switch out. Ooh, well, wait, wait, wait. Switch back. It's nope. still definitely doable. It definitely is. Oh, oh I, I don't like that option. I don't like that option either, because it led to so much of a juggling situation for Cheeks there. Yeah, oh, I think he'll, uh, he'll probably switch over to Pyra as soon as he gets a throw. Oh, tries to go. You're not dead. Oh, oh my, god. my god. If he had a little bit of rage, you actually would have just exploded there. You that, actually would have been on the news. That's crazy. That's so disgusting. Oh, my god. Oh, he is swinging his heart out with the side B, and the next big hit is going to oh. kill. Relax. Oh, yeah. that's there. The confirm jab yeah. in the back air. Superhead was so close. But in the script that we wrote today, it said Cheeks in Winners Finals. And we'll go ahead and get some more storytelling for you uh, at a later point there.